guys, today we're gonna be playing speedrunner versus hunter, and I'm gonna be the speedrunner, and Wudo, you're gonna be the hunter. Haha, <laughs> Mongo, I'm gonna stop you from beating Minecraft. Yeah, well, I'm gonna help him beat Minecraft. Isn't that right, Mongo? Exactly, Axie. With your help, I'm definitely gonna win. But Wudo, is it okay if I can pick one item to help me throughout the speedrun? One item? Are you serious, Mongo? <laughs> of course. Is it me? No, Budo, it's not you. It's gonna be a special item. But if you're fine with it, then I guess I already selected what I want. Look, Axie, I have this item that multiplies blocks, and I just got eight dirt out of nowhere. Whoa, really? Can you multiply me? I probably could, but we need to start running, because look, Wudo's gonna start counting any second. Uh, 10, 9, 8. Come on! Let's go faster than this snail. Let's go, Axie. We don't have that much time, so what I'm gonna do is select this wood, and I'm gonna multiply it to be even more. Whoa, check it out. I just got eight oak logs, and now I can take these blocks, and I can multiply them even more just like this. Axie, look! Now I already have a stack of oak planks. Three two one okay guys it's time for wudo to hunt you down wait a second look wudo's right there Axie. we need to hurry up and run but i'm making a house it doesn't matter Axie. your house is going to get destroyed by me no he has a sword quickly what i'm gonna do is go over here by the river and i'm gonna craft us a bow Axie. you are Okay, hurry up. All I need to do is just place down this crafting table and craft two boats just like this. There you go. Come on, Axie. Jump into the water right now. Okay, I don't need a boat. I'm just gonna swim. Come here, Mongo. I'm gonna get you. Wait a second. Look at Wudo. The water is totally slowing him down, which means we can just go on the other part of the river and we can finally start getting some action items. Axie, come on! I think I see a cave over here. Ooh! Are there gonna be shiny things in there? Yeah, probably, Axie. We can get all types of ores and craft some crazy armor to win against Wudo. Come on, Mongo! Right click the stone! I wanna see what happens. Okay, Axie, check it out. Whenever I click the stone, I get eight cobblestone blocks, but that's not it. Throughout the speed run, my multiplication rate is gonna go higher. So right now I'm getting eight blocks every time I click, but later on, I'm gonna be getting 16, 32, and even 64 blocks every time I click. That means I'm gonna be getting a stack. Whoa, they're all gonna fly out like crazy. Exactly, so come on, let me just collect a bunch of stone just like this but stone can't be the only thing we have let's go find some iron and coal too okay gonna find some iron with my best friend mongo oh here's some coal whoa great find axie all i have to do is right click this and a bunch of coal is spawning in but wait a second we're also getting the levels i'm already level five <laughs> It looks like axolotl poop. Wait a second. The coal doesn't look like axolotl poop. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Have you ever seen axolotl poop? Not really, and I don't think I want to see it anytime soon. Come on, Axie. Could you help me find some iron? And <gasps> look, I see iron right there. Let's jump in the water. Kawapanga! Okay, where's the iron? It's right over here. I just need to build up and right click the iron and whoa check it out we don't even have to mine the iron and wait a second axie i think i feel my multiplication upgrading and whoa check it out my multiplication tool just turned into gold which means we should be getting blocks a lot more than before i can test it out by getting some of these white blocks over here and now i'm getting times 16 of the blocks instead of times eight and what's great about this mod is that we don't even have to break any of the blocks so literally all we have to do is just craft a furnace and then just smell all the iron we got and look i don't even have a single tool on me huh, we'll never even need a pickaxe in this 
Exactly, Axie. So come on, I say we start melting all of these ores and matter of fact what i'm gonna do is just right click that and wait a second axi look all the ores inside of the furnace got multiplied but i also got 16 more furnaces which means we can literally melt through all of the ores super duper fast i'm gonna start making armor whoa great job axi but i also just realized let me throw away all of this iron inside of my inventory and what i can do is just multiply the furnace with iron already inside look this one has four iron inside so what i'm gonna do is take out the coal and then just multiply the singular furnace just like this and look i'm getting a bunch more iron i didn't know you could do that that's so cool exactly so now i'm gonna make myself some iron tools and also some iron armor so we can survive against wudo there's no way wudo can stop us now exactly axi this is literally genius look i have full armor now come on let's exit this cave i'm getting a little hungry yeah now that you mention it my stomach is really empty i haven't eaten in like 20 million days come on axi i think i saw a village nearby we can try to go get some food over there mongo how far is the village i don't want to walk too far my feet hurt you won't have to walk that far axi <laughs> guess what guys i found you and i'm gonna get you wait a second where did wudo come from i don't know but let's get out of here get back here right now i'm not gonna let you guys win this speedrunner versus hunter i will catch you come on axi get on the boat that i built earlier wait what there's no way you guys got in that same boat why didn't i break it Come on, quickly. While Wudo is swimming through the water, we need to get all the food that we can. Luckily, I have my multiplication tool. So we can just look at any food we like and just multiply it. Let's see. What does this village have? We need to look for the plants, Axie. Can we multiply this iron golem? Wait, what? Why would we want to multiply the iron golem, silly? We're looking for food right now. And <gasps> Axie, I see hay bales, which means we can make a bunch of bread food i also see some carrots here carrots okay hold on let me just multiply this hay bale over here and wait a second axie i already have a stack of hay bales which means i can just take these hay bales into my inventory make a bunch of wheat just like that and now i just need to take the bread just like this and axie guess what i have three stacks of bread oh three stacks let's go multiply this stuff and then we can make a carrot sandwich a carrot sandwich we don't need that silly we have more than enough food and we have so much food that we can also feed all the animals nearby axie so come on just take all this food and feed everyone can we feed mr sheep sure we can definitely feed mr sheep all i need to do is just feed him that wheat and look now he's so fed and i think i even see some cows over there that we can feed axie cows let me feed you carrots but axie i just realized we're inside of a village which means the villagers should have some items we can trade for right what about this weird guy he looks really stylish wait a second this villager looks a little too cool let me right click him real quick and <gasps> what in the world axi it's our lucky day this villager trades so many cool op things and all we need are these simple items to trade for them simple items like what crafting tables wheat seeds and oak boat oh my gosh i have some of those items already come on i'm gonna get myself one of these real quick and whoa this is called strength buff which means whenever i have this in my inventory i'm gonna have strength for forever let's see i can try killing something real quick and i'm super strong now come on get all the other stuff real quick 
okay to get the other items i need some different things for this one i need 32 dirt hold on let me just use my multiplication tool on the ground just like this and now i should have more than enough dirt let me just go over here and just right click him and boom i have this tool called a terraformer and this thing mines everything super quick why does that weirdo want so much dirt anyway i don't know this villager is a little strange so i'll do only one or two more trades with him look i want this bazooka i bet it's gonna be super duper op axie okay get it and then we can make a weirdo go Boom. let's see can i try to multiplicate this stick over here i'm trying to right click it and wait a second it's not working so the only thing we can do is place down some oak over here multiply this and then go into our inventories and craft a bunch of sticks that way now that we have enough sticks i can just go over here and get ourselves a bazooka oh my gosh axie do you want one too yeah but i'm making a house right now wait a second you're making a house why in the world would you be making a house because i have so much random cobblestone i'm gonna live here forever no axie you can't live here forever we need to go beat the ender dragon remember come on you can even trade some of this cobblestone for some items with this villager hurry up and do it before wood arrives okay okay uh hey weird guy trade with me look trade for the sword that takes a bunch of cobblestone and let's see what it looks like whoa it looks super cool here i got two good job axie and thank you for the sword we're gonna be using this against the wudo <laughs> hey mongo axie i see you guys what are you doing talking to that villager wait a second look it's wudo and he has a diamond sword axie come on we need to run hey where do you guys think you're going i told you to stop wait a second axie follow me over here i think i have a strategy in mind all i need to do is just multiply this villager ready okay do it do it okay three two one boom i'm multiplying him right now look it's working hey what which one of you is mongo and axie why are there so many villagers come on axie get into the open area and let's see how confused wudo is hey mongo axie where did you go and where did all of these villagers come from i didn't see these guys anywhere god ah, take my rage villagers <laughs> we totally got him axie come on let's just use our bazooka on him and run uh, ouch, what was that come on axie we need to run this way so far we only have iron armor so we need to upgrade our armor so we can survive against wudo's diamond sword and <gasps> wait a second i think i see a huge cave over here and i see cows perfect for making op leather armor wait a second we don't need cows silly leather armor is worse than iron armor so we need to upgrade our armor not downgrade it oh okay i'm gonna jump down let's go be careful though axie this cave is super huge and super big and <gasps> look i already see some cool ores down there follow me axie whoa this cave is super big mongo don't get lost wait i'm not getting lost axie look i think i found a mine shaft over here a mine shaft aren't those usually kind of dangerous they are axie but don't worry i'm by your side and we have these super cool weapons that we can use and look i already found some valuable items that we can get from this mine shaft do you see these cobwebs over here how are cobwebs valuable well if i just try to break them and oh gosh i thought multiplying the cobwebs would give us even more cobwebs but instead they're dropping strings and we don't really need strings come on axie let's keep exploring this cave we really need to find some diamonds diamonds where are you do you think diamonds 
diamonds can talk. No, diamonds can't talk, silly. They're ores. And wait a second. What is this little contraption over here? Who in the world could have made this, Axie? I don't know. Maybe some weird cave hermit. There's nothing in here, but we can multiply all of these items. Whoa, look, there's a brewing stand. Let's get that. Maybe that'll be useful in the future. Yeah, who Maybe we can make a really good soup. Whoa, look, I see gold over here, Axie. Let me just multiply a ton of gold, and now we're super rich. Let's go buy a fancy car. Sure, we could totally do that. But first, what I'm going to do is take this gold and make a bunch of golden blocks. Why are we making golden blocks again? Because we're going to be super rich, of course. Look, let me just multiply this gold over here just like this. And now I just need to take these. And now look, Axie, I have a bunch of golden blocks and all i have to do is just place one down and i can keep clicking but wait a second i think the tool is upgrading again yeah axie look it just got upgraded to a diamond multiplier which means whenever i right click i get times 32 of the items that i click we're gonna be so rich for life look i'm multiplying all of these gold over here and i think there's stacks and stacks of them all over the place oh my god Gosh, I'm gonna replace all the iron in my inventory and I'm gonna be super duper rich now. This is awesome! Mongo, where do we go next? Well, we need some diamonds. So come on, let's just quickly look for some diamonds and we can get out of this cave. Wait, Mongo, look! How did we miss this? It's a diamond ore! Wait a second, Axie. We really did miss that diamond. I don't remember seeing it there, but let's just mine around it. Let's see how many diamonds are there and um axi there's one singular diamond block but you know why that doesn't matter why because we have my multiplication tool of course look i just need to do this and oh my gosh look how many diamonds are spawning in so much experience too. Yup, I have literally unlimited diamonds now. What I'm gonna do is go over here to the crafting menu, and I'm just gonna make them into diamond blocks just like this, and then we're gonna do the same thing that we did with the gold. We're just gonna keep right-clicking it just like that, and boom, we're getting an abnormal amount of diamonds. Oh my gosh, did you ever see this many diamonds in your life, Axie? Nope, look at my new shiny diamond diamond armor wait a second you made diamond armor you're a genius axie let me do the same all i have to do is just make a crafting table then i just have to make some leggings and of course i can't forget about the helmet and the boots just like that there you go axie we now have more than enough of everything we need let me just put this in and now we can mine out of here come on let's go Come on, Axie. Are you still following me? Yeah, Mongo. Just keep mining. Yeah, I feel like we've been at this cave forever. And wait a second. What in the world did we just mine into? <gasps> it's my family. Wait, your family? What are you talking about? Look, they're everywhere, Mongo. My axolotl family. Oh my gosh, you're right. There's so many axolotls here. They're so cute too. But unfortunately, we need to get out of this cave. So come on, Axie, let's leave. Wait, we can't leave yet. What do you mean, Axie? We're doing a speedrunner versus hunter challenge. But look at them, Mongo. They have nothing here but this cold cave. We have to help them. Well, how are we supposed to help them, silly? Well, we could build them a city. Build them a city with what? With, I don't know, whatever random stuff we can duplicate. I guess you're right, Axie. We do have a bunch of diamonds and golds that we have nothing to do with. Okay, come on. We're not going to spend too long doing this. I'm just going to quickly do this to help you and your Axolotl family out. Let's first build a single house over here, just like this. There you go. Come on, Axie. Could you help me build too? Okay. 
I'm gonna build one over here. Okay, there you go. This is gonna be the first house, and we're gonna need to build a few of these houses if these axolotls are gonna be living good. So what I'm gonna do is also build out of gold. That way, they have all types of blocks that they can live with. Let me just do this real quick, just like this. There you go. And now that we have that, we now have a gold and a diamond house, Axie. That's so cool. Okay, I'm gonna put some water inside the houses so that they don't dry up. Oh, great idea. I just realized too, I can multiply a bunch of these blocks that are around the cave and I can place more of them around because they probably love them. So let me grab a bunch of lily pads over here, just like this. And then I can also grab these flowering azulas and I'm going to place them all over the place for them to enjoy. Sounds good, Mongo. Let me just place them all over, over here. And then let me place a bunch of lily pads on the water over here as well oh my gosh these axolotls are so cute and if you think axolotls are cute hit that subscribe button you have three seconds three two one thank you so much for subscribing but now that we're done with that all i need to do is just place on a few more and axie how is the water in the house is going good look there's already axolotls that have moved into this house that's great. Come on. Can you place some water over here as well so the axolotls can go inside of that house? Okay. There you go. That should be perfect, Axie. Look, these axolotls are so excited to move in already. I'm sure they are. There's a whole neighborhood now. Whoa, now they have three houses all to themselves. And they also have a bunch of these drip leaves along with a bunch of flooring azulas or whatever they're called. But come on, Axie. Now that we're done with this, we can leave the cave. Okay. I'll be back to visit Stinky. Don't worry. I think it's a perfect time for me to make a visit actually and test out my brand new invention the tnt wand wait don't do that you're gonna hurt my family wait a second wudo came back and he has diamond armor and a tool called tnt wand what in the world i bet that doesn't even do anything axie come on let's just walk away he doesn't want to fight us okay i guess you're right it probably does nothing knowing wudo Oh, really, Axie? Well, why don't we try it out? <laughs> Wait a second. That TNT tool literally blew everything up. What is going on, Axie? The axolotls. I'll kill you, Wuda. Where are you? Don't worry, Axie. The axolotls are fine. I just wanted to destroy your guys' hard work so that you guys give up and that I win the speedrunner challenge. I'll still kill you, Wudo. Come on, Axie. We don't have time to fight him right now. We need to run. He's going to explode everything, including us. So let's just run away. Okay, fine. But I'll be back. Don't worry, Axolotls. You're okay with Wudo. Those stinky guys, Mongo and Axie, don't care about you. Okay, Axie, just follow me. I'm going to break out of this cave right now. Mongo, how long have we been mining for? We finally lost him. I know, Axie. I'm just trying to get back to surface. And <gasps> wait a second. I think we're super close to surface. Look, I'm mining all these blocks. And I think I see the surface. Now all we need to do is just build up just like this. And boom, Axie, we're finally here. And wait, what? A desert pyramid? Look, Axie, it's a desert pyramid. That's nice, but I'm still sad about the axolotls. Oh, gosh, I am too, Axie. But don't worry. We can get some sweet, sweet revenge on Wudo. From what I remember, desert pyramids have TNT in them. So what if we go and multiply the TNT, Axie? Oh, yeah. You're right. It's time for revenge. Yup. Let's just go inside of this desert pyramid and let me just mine down just like this. And actually, below these blocks is where the TNT is. Go ahead, Mongo. Mine it before Wudo finds us. 
Look, Axie, I see all the TNT here. So come on, let me just throw away all the rubbish in my inventory and I can grab the TNT. Ready? I'm going to multiply so many of them in three, two, one, boom. Oh my gosh, we're going to have an infinite supply of TNT. This is going to be amazing. And we're going to explode it all in Wudo's face. Yup, exactly, Axie. That's the game plan. But I think we're better off actually making a trap that Wudo is going to fall for than to just use it to explode him. What do you say? Maybe you're right. Where do we put the trap? Come on, Axie. We just need to find a clear area just like this and we can dig a huge hole. So can you please help me dig? Uh, no. Nah just sit and watch you. Wait, what? I thought you were the one that wanted revenge on Wudo, though. Yeah, but I don't have a pickaxe. Okay, fine, Axie. I guess I'll do this myself. Come on, just watch me real quick, and I'm gonna dig the biggest hole in Minecraft. Do it. And there you go, Axie. We now have a giant hole that we can use to trap Wudo, but do you know how this trap is gonna work? Uh, I assume it's gonna do something like go boom. Well, something like that, Axie. But what we're gonna be doing is placing down a bunch of TNT. Then on top of the TNT, we're gonna place down some sand. And then on top of that, we're gonna put some pressure plates. So the TNT falls straight down to the floor and Wudo is stuck down there. Oh! But can he just mine up? No, he can't mine up, silly. Because the TNT is also going to go boom down there. Oh, that's super evil. Exactly. So come on, let's just place down a bunch of TNT. Thankfully, we have like an unlimited supply of them. So we don't really need to worry. But now that we're done with that, all we need to do is just place down a bunch of sand on top of them. So let me just do that real quick. And wait a second, Axie, don't place them just yet i need to remember where the tnts are so i can actually place down the pressure plates on top of them so how about this let's just craft some pressure plates and then let's place them one by one so we remember where it is so all i need to do is just place it just like this but whatever you do axie make sure you do not touch the pressure plates okay okay i'm not that clumsy you know all right all we need to do is just complete this quickly before wudo finds us come on on. let me just place down all of these pressure plates just like this and actually this is gonna be trap of the year i can't wait for wudo to fall for it come on these are the final few blocks and actually guess what what are we done we are officially done with the trap so come on we should just wait for wudo to come by now and we're so gonna get him let's just hide inside of this desert pyramid follow me wait i'm just gonna put some last pressure plates Hurry up, hurry up. But wait, Mongo, I have an even better idea. I'm gonna put some cake down so that Wudo will want to cross the pressure plates. Oh, great idea, Axie, but hurry up. Come over here and hide with me. Let me just eat one first. Wait a second, you're taking too long. I think I hear Wudo. I'm coming. All right, all right, hide. Ooh, what's this? I'm picking up on the scent of Mongo and Axie, and it's leading me over there this direction and oh my gosh look at that is that a bunch of cake that they left for me oh they're so nice look wudo's about to fall for an axie yeah come on come on come on okay well in that case if this cake is for me i might as well just cross over these real quick and uh, uh, what's going on why is there tnt here Oh my gosh, what in the world? Look at Wudo. He just exploded all the way down there. We got him so good. What in the world was that? Thank goodness I had my full diamond armor in. <gasps> Hold on a second. Is that Mongo and Axie I see up there? You guys set up this trap to kill me, didn't you? Come on, Axie. We need to run quickly. The last and final thing we need to do to defeat the Ender Dragon is go to the nether so come on we need to find some lava real quick and <gasps> look there's 
there's lava over here. Do you have a water bucket? All we need is some obsidian. Yeah, I do. Here, take it. Okay, let me just take this water bucket, place it down just like this. And now I can just go over here and right click this obsidian. And look, we have a bunch of obsidian now. Come on, let me build this nether portal so we can go over to the nether and complete our mission. Let me just place these down just like this. Oh gosh, we have to hurry. Woodo is going to be here any second. Do you have a flint and steel? Yeah, one moment and there we go. All right, let's go, Axie. We're going to go to the nether. To the and boom i think we're inside of the nether now axie but wait a second what is our luck we spawned in in another fortress that's amazing yeah hopefully no more bad things happen to us all we need now is some blazes and some endermen but look i see some blazes right there and they're trying to attack us so let's get them oh i see somebody's trying to kill some blazes in the nether i don't think so mongo <laughs> wait a second look it's wudo and he has tnt in his hand come on axie quickly we must kill these mobs and get some ender pearls and blaze rods and <gasps> look i got an ender pearl right there there. so all we need is a blaze rod and wait did you get one yeah i have it let's go okay give me a really quickly come on oh mongo axie look above you i have a bow and that means i can snipe you from above we're not scared of you wudo no we are scared of him come on axie we need to run look at him he looks super overpowered let me just quickly play some obsidian so he can't get to us there you go this obsidian wall should stop him for a little bit come on i thought of a magical idea that we can use to get a bunch more of these ender pearls and blaze rods do you know what that is is it duplication exactly axie so let me just place this down over here a chest and now whenever i multiply this chest i get whatever is inside of it too so look axie i literally just got 16 ender pearls and 13 blaze rods without even doing anything so you're saying all that's left to do is find the ender dragon exactly we need to find the stronghold but in order to do that we need to go back to the overworld and run from wudo so come on let's run this way oh mongo i'm blowing up this obsidian you put down oh gosh axie but let's just make another ender portal over here to run away because there is no way we're gonna be able to run away far enough from wudo so let me just place down these blocks over here to make the portal just like this there you go oh my gosh i placed down an obsidian by mistake let me just break this real quick how far away is wudo axie he's right behind us okay i just broke that obsidian and now quickly light up that portal and let me block off wudo just like this uh, get over here come on block him off with the obsidian so he can't get to us uh, now get in the portal before he blows it up okay you go in first come on i'm gonna keep placing down the obsidian mongo i'm gonna blow this up no wudo you forgot that obsidian doesn't blow up silly so you're gonna have to spend all your time mining this good luck i'm leaving i don't think so mongo get over here bye wudo and boom now i'm in the overworld and look axie you're here with me yeah but we have no time to waste we have to find the stronghold okay don't worry all i need to do is just turn these blaze rods into blaze powder just like this and then now i have eyes of ender which we can use to find that stronghold look the stronghold is this way let's follow it axie let's go look axie i'm using the ender eyes but it seems like they're going down over here which means the end portal must be right underneath us uh, but i'm also right here mongo did you think you could get away from me oh gosh wudo is still following us axie come on i'm gonna use my bazooka on him and we should just mine down quickly i'll hold him up i'll be right behind you oh okay let me 
just keep mining while Axie is holding him off. Please, please, please. And Portal B here. And wait, what? This is a cave. This is not the stronghold. Oh my gosh. How much more am I going to be mining for? And wait a second. I think I reached the stronghold. Hey, Axie, jump down the hole. I finally found it. Okay, I'm coming down. And look, I even found the end portal right there as well. Let me just place down all of these eyes and we can go to the nether. Oh gosh, I just need to make a few more eyes of ender just like this. And I have just enough. Come on, Axie. Are you ready to go in there? Yeah, but what is right behind us? I found the stronghold too, guys. And I'm going to finally kill you. No, you're not, Voodoo. We're inside of the end and we're going to take down the ender dragon. Come on, Axie, follow me. I'm right behind you. Where's Voodoo? He should be coming in any second, which means we need to hurry up. Let's just break through these and wait a second. I finally reached the surface. Come on, I'm going to place down some obsidian over here so Voodoo can't mine through. And now we can go take out that ender dragon let's go okay but mongo we have to start by breaking the crystals here take this oh thank you axie do you have any arrows with that as well yeah right there okay now that i have these i can actually break the crystals all i have to do is just aim there and now that we're breaking these crystals it'll make it so the ender dragon doesn't heal up again come on let's take all them out Woodle should be coming any second now oh mongo I am now in the end. Wait a second. Do you hear him, Axie? He's over here already. Already? Yup. Come on. Let me just take out these final crystals and we can start killing the ender dragon. We don't need to worry about Wudo anymore. Hang on. I'm just trying to get this one. Oh, it seems like you guys are trying to destroy crystals, but I'm going to destroy you instead. Wait a second, Axie. There's one more crystal. Don't listen to Wudo, okay? Just get it for me. Okay, Mongo. I got them. They're all destroyed. Wait, look. I see Wudo right there. Come on. Let's take him down before we take down the dragon. Oh, Mongo. You won't be able to take me down, silly. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Voodoo? My sword lets me shoot out a fireball whenever I want. Uh, um, okay. And what am I supposed to do about that, Mongo? It still won't take me down. You're supposed to die. Yeah, Voodoo, you're getting taken down. Take this. Uh, no, you take this, Mongo. Ouch, ouch, spicy, spicy. This is what happens when you mess with Mongo and Axie, Voodoo. Take this TNT. Wait a second, Axie, run. His face numb TNT. Okay, you know what? Forget Voodoo. I'm just gonna focus on the dragon. Let me just bow him down just like this. There you go. And look, Axie, I'm at my final arrow, which means I just need to shoot him just like this. Come on, dragon. You're not gonna get away. And oh my gosh, he's literally at 0.5 health, Axie. Axie, come on, shoot him. Okay, just have to hit one more arrow and I think one more. Yes, all we need is one more. Come on, Axie, don't miss. It's hard. He's flying everywhere. Yup, but you got this. And boom, Axie, you hit him, which means we win the game because we defeated the Ender Dragon. No, are you serious? Yup, Pudo, and guess what else I'm gonna do? What? I'm gonna take my multiplication tool and I'm gonna duplicate the dragon egg over here, Wudo. The multiplication tool? What do you mean multiplication tool? Well, remember when I asked you if there was an item I can just pick and you said, sure, whatever, go ahead. Well, Wudo, that item is this one right here and it lets me multiply any items in the world. Look, I have a bunch of bedrock and dragon eggs inside of my inventory. So literally, I can place you inside of this bedrock and you'll never be able to escape. What in the world? No! Bye, Wudo. We win this speedrunner versus hunter. Let's go. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed, then watch another video on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye.